Hello everyone. Today we are dealing with the topic phytogeography which is included in the Kerala University syllabus of SYUG Botany. So what is phytogeography? Phytogeography is actually the science dealing with the origin, distribution and environmental interrelationship of plants. So if you split the word phytogeography, phyto means plants and geography means location. In other terms, it is the study of the origin, environmental relations and global distribution of plants both in time and space. There are basically two types of phytogeography. First one is historical which deals with the distribution of plants, their evolution and dispersal. The second one is ecological which deals with the geographical distribution of plants in relation to the environment and other ecological factors. Ecological factors can be biotic as well as abiotic. Now, there are two major branches of phytogeography. First one is the descriptive phytogeography, which deals with the distribution of plant communities in the different geographical regions of the world. Second is interpretive phytogeography, which deals with the impelling causes, the probable methods and the essential conditions of plant distribution, migration and evolution. So what is the basic difference between the two? Descriptive phytogeography deals with only the distribution of plants in different zones of the world. But interpretive phytogeography, it includes the probable causes of plant distribution and various factors which are affecting the distribution of plants in different parts of the world. So what is the significance of phytogeography? Firstly, it provides a clear picture of the vegetation present in the past and also in the present time. Next, it provides a worldwide elucidation of plants in different parts of the world. It also reveals the centers of origin of plants and the various biotic and bio abiotic factors which control the plant distribution. It also provides an idea about the various climatic conditions and vegetational types of an area which has been known in the remote past and it also provides the pattern of floristic, floristic evolution by which the distribution of plants can be known. Thank you.